Okay, wonderful. Can you hear me? Yes. Awesome. Um, so I wanted to ask you a few questions about your hearing aids. Um, do you wear a hearing aid every day regularly? I'm sorry. I, I really couldn't hear you that well. Oh, sorry. Can you can you hear me now? Better. Um, do you wear a hearing aid every day regularly? Did I what? Do you wear a hearing aid every day regularly? Yes. And how long have you been wearing hearing aids for? Ooh. Um, maybe 10 or 15 years. 10 or 15 years. Okay. And of those 10 or 15 years, how often did you purchase a new hearing aid? Like, do you wear them the same one for six years or? No, I um, gee, I I don't. How often do I have I purchased a new hearing aid? Huh? It's hard to think. Twice. Yeah, Twice. probably. Yeah, once once every six or eight years. Once every six or eight years. Okay. And um, do you ever have? problems with your hearing aids, um, you know, functionality or any of the features or whatnot? Where what? Do you do you have any problems with your hearing aids, like how how they work or the features or functions of it? Well, um, I do have problems. Uh, one of them is in a crowded restaurant, for instance. It's very difficult. With background, if there's background noises, it's hard for me to hear anything. Um, also, if I go to a, 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 a session where somebody's making a speech, if if that person, if the if the acoustics are not really good, um, and if I'm not able to halfway read lips too I have a terrible time with with uh, people talking over uh, audio systems mm -hmm. and can you adjust that at all can I what can you Could adjust do anything that about it no no Whoa. um and are your hearing aids the nude color ones are they what? Are they the the tan, the beige colored ones? I have, yeah. My there's a the left hand is blue and the right hand is red. Oh, that's on nice. the inside. Um, does that help you with um knowing which ear to put it into? Huh? Does that help you knowing which ear to put it into? Oh, yeah. Okay. And are you currently on any medication? On uh, what? Are you currently on any medication? Oh, yeah. I take a lot of medicine. Uh, I'm a diabetic, and I have some, I've had some heart surgery. Um, and so I take medication for both of those. Uh, how how do you do a medication management system? Do you set up daily reminders on your phone or handwritten, or does your wife help you? No, I uh, the doctor makes prescriptions and uh, I pick them up at the at the um, uh, CVS and uh, follow the directions and. Okay. Uh, so you remembered to take them every day. Oh yeah, I have a pill box and it has the days AM and PM on it and I fill that up at the beginning of the week and so I know which one I'm working on. So I every morning at breakfast time I take the the AM pills and then in the evening uh I take 
the PM pills. Mm -hmm. And have you ever forgotten to take any medication? Oh, sure. sure. Yeah, and were there oh, were there any side effects of that? No, I no. just follow the directions, which is if it's been a significant amount of time, just wait for the next one. Right. Okay. And do you use your cell phone for any reminders at all? I try to avoid it, but I do when absolutely necessary. It's more difficult for me to hear than it is for the landline. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. So if you could change anything to help um, with your hearing aid, if, if you could almost wave a magic wand, right, and, and change anything to improve your hearing aid as well as, um, you know, medication reminders, what, what would you do? If I could, if I could do something different? Yes. Uh, I don't know. I, the alternatives uh, are to, uh, they have, they're very expensive. Uh, and secondly, the other alternative is, is some kind of surgical implant. And I'm not I'm not interested in either of those alternatives, so I just move all along. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then how how is it when you put the phone up to your hearing aid? I'm sorry. Do you have any problems when you put the phone up to your hearing aid, like the touch of it or anything like that? Uh, sometimes I get a little ringing feedback, but uh, otherwise nothing. Otherwise, nothing. And do you ever, um, you know, put in ear, ear pods, like, to listen to music or... I'm sorry, to do what? Do you ever put on headphones to listen to music? No, no. 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 Uh, okay. So it seems, yeah, um, it's interesting because it seems like the ringing and the feedback that you get from the different... Uh, environments you walk into seems like your biggest issue, right, with the hearing aids? I'm sorry, I didn't get that. The feedback, what about it? Uh, it seems like the feedback and um, environmental sounds in busy well, if areas. Well, if I adjust the, the thing, it goes away. So if you adjust it, it goes That's away. That's just a temporary thing. It's a temporary thing. Yeah. Okay. And I wonder how you could change that for it to automatically adjust. Don't know. Yeah. Um, thank you so much. Um, are you then, are you interested in getting hearing aids? Um, not for myself. Um, I am doing a research project for school, and we're just looking into hearing aids. Okay. Uh, I got mine at Costco, and they give you a test, hearing test, and then help uh, order what you need. So, uh, and and it's it's I guess as inexpensive as anything, but that's also I have a hearing. Uh, um, doctor mm -hmm. um, so anyway do they does your doctor recommend hearing aids to use uh, yeah and are you wearing one of his or hers recommendations she she gave me a hearing aid test and plotted the the problems and suggested what I should do about it mm-hmm in my case, uh, I was a, in a I was a tank driver in the army, and she suggested wow. that I get in touch with the with the Veterans Administration and see if they would give me some help in purchasing uh, more advanced hearing aids. Right. 
Wow. Yeah, because hearing aids can get pretty expensive. Yes. Especially with the especially with the new ones in the market. Yeah, I would I would say a decent pair is going to cost at least five thousand bucks. Five thousand? Yeah. Wow. That ain't cheap. (laughs) Yeah. Wow. And so, um, how many more years do you have left with this hearing aid? Because you said it last. How many more years do you have left with wearing the same hearing aid? Because you say six to eight years you switch uh, it. Uh, probably about three or four. Three or four. Yeah. Okay. And then um, going back to uh, our uh, earlier in our conversation, you said that you do use your cell phone to set medication reminders if it's extremely necessary, but yes. it's hard because you can't hear your cell phone Yeah, it's alarm. not as clear as the landline. It's not as clear as the landline. Right. Um, and uh, does, does your wife help take care of um, any reminding at all, medication reminders? And she done it what? Here, Did let me, she... you can ask her here. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. What's your name? My name's Fiza. Fiza. Okay, what can I, I do for you? I'm friends with Linda. Uh-huh. Um, oh, I was just asking if um, if you help your husband at all with reminding him of medication. Um reminding him sometimes at night sometimes at night yeah. and how how do you remember <laughs> <laughs> well usually the the little boxes are right out there so i just have become accustomed to looking in the box to see if the medicine's you know been taken and if it hasn't then i'll just remind john oh great okay and um out of curiosity do you use um like uh, your cell phone at all for daily reminders? Uh, no, no. Okay. Um, you. We don't have we don't have those kind of cell phones. You don't what? We don't have those kind of cell phones. Our cell oh, phones are as old as the hills. Phones? Yeah, oh, they okay. don't do any of those things. Oh, okay. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> um, but I would like to thank you both so much. Um, You've answered all of my questions, so I really appreciate it, and um, this will be very helpful for my school project. Excellent. So, and what is your school project? Um, we're just doing re- research on hearing aids. Okay. <laughs> and the effect um, it has on people's lives. And... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, um, and, and any issues they come across with hearing aids. Um, mm-hmm. So... But it's been extremely helpful. I really appreciate it. And, well, you're welcome. Um, and please tell John. I don't know if I could if I could say thank you to him as well. Okay, hold um, on, and okay. you can hold on. Okay, great. Thanks. Thank you. Hello. Hi, John. Thank you so much for answering my questions. I really appreciate it. Hey, anything I can do to help, Isa, I'd be happy to. So anytime. Just think of other questions. Uh, give me a call. Oh, thank you so much. And I do want to say I love Linda. I've known her since I was pretty much a baby. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, but thank you so much, and yeah. have a great Sunday. Thank you. You Thanks. too. Thank right. you. Bye. Bye-bye.